In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to make a shooting effect in Adobe After Effects. For this tutorial, we will be using this free stock footage. Here, we will add the smoke whenever the gun recoils, to give the clip a more realistic shooting effect. First of all, let's position the seek bar at the exact frame where the object is just about to shoot. That is, the frame where we would expect gun smoke to come out. Next, we will add gun smoke in the composition. The muzzle flash smoke stock footage we will be using in this tutorial can be downloaded from footagecrate.com. Once the file has been downloaded, let's bring it to the After Effects sequence over the original clip layer. After that, let's position the layer at the frame where we stopped previously in the timeline. Notice that the gun smoke is starting from the left side, while the gun itself is being pointed from the right side. To sync it with the shot, we would have to rotate the footage so that the smoke is coming out of the gun's head. Now make sure that the smoke layer is selected. With that done, you can press the R key on the keyboard, and this would activate the rotate option. Now we will rotate the smoke footage according to the shot, and place it next to the gun, like so. Keep working with the rotation option, and make sure the smoke appears right at the edge of the gun's head. You can zoom in the footage to position it in a better way. With that done, make sure the clip is selected, and now let's press the P key to activate the position option. Since the gun is moving, we would want to animate the position of the smoke as well. For that, let's click on the stopwatch icon next to the position option to animate it. Now we will move forward in the timeline, and change the position of the smoke according to the gun till the time it's visible in the frame. You can see over here that, at this point, the smoke is still out of the screen, so no need to animate the position over here. Okay, so in this clip, we have, like, multiple gunshots. So let's bring the gun smoke stock footage once more in the composition. Next, we will move the seek bar at the exact frame when the object is about to shoot for the second time. After that, let's move the clip to that exact frame where we stopped previously. With that done, we will position and animate the shot exactly like we did previously. Keep doing this for as many gunshots you have in the footage. Once done, let's render the sequence, and this is what the output will look like at the end. And that's basically how you can make a shooting effect in Adobe After Effects. Thanks for watching. This was a HowTech.tv tutorial.